Good morning, happy August 6th. Hope everyone is well and happy on this beautiful Sunday outside. We have a few selections today. We want to recap the horses yesterday and I just want to say sad about Maple Leaf Mel had a fatal injury in Saratoga yesterday. It was going to win the race but uh, sadly broke down. I hear Yola Rosario is doing okay. He got a few stitches to the face and um, he's off all his mounts today which would be expected. So uh, condolences to connections of that horse. That horse was a, a gallant horse actually. Very consistent and would have got his grade one win yesterday. Sad for connections really and uh, what a beautiful horse. Always the good ones go like that. Sad. So recapping yesterday, we hit the crossbar far too many times yesterday. Um, let's just go over a few of them. Kings River Knight, I looked home on hose, then it just got ran out of it in the last few strides. So um, the horse ran with very, very good consistency and uh, I thought we were going to stay on for the win, but sadly it wasn't to be. So we just got ran out of it near the end. Elm Drive did what I told you it would do, ran from ran out like the clappers from the start and just got collared late home, actually finished third. So the step up and trip uh, was a bit too much for this horse, really. He needs to go back to, down to six, I believe. And Cody's Wish in the Whitney, White Obero won the race. Uh, very good uh, result for White Obero. Um, actually surprised me yesterday, which I don't usually get surprised anymore. But I uh, was very uh, surprised yesterday with that horse. Uh, Cody's Wish never looked like, very ran very flat. Didn't look like wanted any part of the race yesterday. So... Um, Maybe it's been a long all year for the horse. Maybe the horse just needs to be put out to a paddock and come back refreshed. That uh, sometimes happens with horses that are overly done. You know, there's only a few good races in some horses every year. Web Slinger, second again, was unlucky. Uh, adjusted the farm from Fairbridge, so I did get, get that one right, but didn't get the win. And Dakota Gold, another second for us. Uh, just couldn't get by. And um, that's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes. Well, we're all running into farm, which... Uh, It'd be more of a disaster if they weren't hitting the board. So we have three selections today. There's a good racing in Mountaineer Park. Let's start there. I don't usually go there for my races, but there's a great tree down, down there today. I see Kendrick Camus has gone down there for the long ride down there. So uh, keep an eye on them horses for Kendrick. He doesn't often go away from Saratoga for nothing. Um, race 7 Mountaineer Park. I have a horse here, O'Connor. Ran second in Gulfstream and a great tree. And uh, I believe it's head and shoulders above the rest. Down there, Mountaineer Park. I got two to one this morning, which I I'm blessed to get it. To be quite honest, uh, I think it's a show in this horse. O'Connor race seven, Mountaineer Park. Then in Delmar, we have a horse here, race nine, Grand Slam Smile. Ran uh, one over five furlongs last time out. This is a speedy filly. Let me tell you, this is a speed store, speed store, speed store. This will win again today. Um, so mark your card with this one, Grand Slam Smile. And race 8 Saratoga, I have Here You Come Again. Uh, this horse won in Ellis Park last time. I was very impressed with this horse. Uh, has, uh, it's very tough, this race, to pick a winner, but uh, I think this one will do all the winning here. Here You Come Again, race 8 Saratoga. So that's it for me today. Hope everyone is doing well. Let's hope we can finish the weekend on a good note. And uh, I'll see you back here all Saturday. God bless you all.